chapter 20 and we're finally getting to like the big conflict of the book. So once again, writing this book, like the chapters have typically been closer to 1000 words, like usually under like 1500-ish. And this one was like one word shy of 2,000 words, which is still like half of the previous chapter, but that's fine. Again, I have a round of editing just for that. But it's kind of fun to actually get into like the final fight of things and like actually dealing with stuff. And so I'm very excited for how it's turning out. This one also went by really fast. It's fun to switch around which characters you're telling the story from because this time it's Louis. And I've never actually written from his point of view, which is really fun to actually get to do. Granted, it's in like the last little bit of the book, but still. This also means that I did hit my writing goal for today, which was to write two chapters. So I got 19 and 20 done. And it's so weird to feel like the finals of <laughs> this book are like on the horizon because like it's almost here. And so I only have a couple more days and then it's gonna be the end of this book. And it's so weird to be getting like the final lead up into this book that I've been working on for so long. And it's like, oh my God, it's like, it's like the stuff that needs to happen is actually happening. And like, it's really like, it's also at the point where it's like, I'm excited to get to the end and I'm really excited of where this is going. And then the part of your brain kicks in of like, oh, but like plot things you need to fix. <laughs> and it's like, Neh. like at this point, I'm just starting to add it into like a little notes section on the outline. Again, I talked about that last time of the Google Sheets basically of like stuff that I know that I need to go and like probably check and see if I explain it enough. And then I might need to add that in as I go through the rounds of editing because I'm like, I feel like, because again, I've kept the story for so long that the stuff I had set up in book one in like 2012-ish when I started to actually write it. And definitely by the time like it was 2014 when I published it. And so the idea of where the story was going then versus now are completely different. <laughs> so it's like, I need to make sure that I connect what was supposed to be the big bad battle from here and where I'm wanting it to be now to like kind of connect. And I just need to make sure that like I'm explaining that well because it did change. And like, I just need to deal with it. However, that is for editing because right now I still need to hit the end. <laughs> and honestly, being so close to the end, it does make me want to just keep writing. But I think there is something to be said about taking a break and like, not like a long break, like tomorrow, but to pump the brakes for the day, acknowledge that it's like, I'm excited for where it's going. I have this like momentum that I've been building, having been working on this for like pretty frequently for the past little bit that I haven't done for so long. And honestly, it is truly just the thing of like, you build momentum by actually just sitting down and doing it, which is like every writer advice ever, <laughs> like not waiting for inspiration, just sit down and figure it out, which is hard, don't get me wrong, but it has really helped. So that now when I'm close to the end, I'm not going to let myself burn myself out by being like, well, I'll just finish it because then it's gonna feel too rushed. And so I'm just like, I can feel the excitement building as the end is getting so close and that it's like we're in the final things, but also I'm still kind of dragging it out just a little bit and I want the ending to happen the way I do now. But again, now I just have to make notes to make sure that it actually makes sense from book one to now because <laughs> shockingly, like nine years later, trying to maintain that storyline has changed. <laughs> and so anyways, Chapter 20 went really well. I don't know that Louis is gonna have another chapter point of view. I'm gonna switch it up. Honestly, I think pretty much every character at this point is gonna rotate to the end and just get their story told from their point of view. And then we'll see. But like, yeah, I'm very excited <laughs> to get this book done and then to move on to writing other books and just have standalones and have this magical moment happening way more frequently than um, like, you know, Eight year, nine years ago, <laughs> last October, or was it September? I think it was September, not October. In September, that's a long gap. And then now it'll be in the spring, obviously, when I get to have this published. So I'm just, I'm very excited. And this, I didn't have the excited the end 
as much in book two as I'm going to with this one. There's just something about getting this done this fast compared from book one to book two to get done. So I'm very excited to finally be having this actually manifest into the world. I just wanted to talk a little bit about chapter 20. I would love to hear how your writing is going in the comments down below. Make sure to like and subscribe. I post every other day and until next time, thank you so much for watching and I'll see y'all soon.